Welcome to your intentions program. I am so excited to have you here and to guide you through the next 14 days of Pilates workouts, setting intentions, and getting clear on what you wanna create for yourself this year. Today we are getting started with a power Pilates workout. I'm wearing a pair of one pound ankle weights and adding a pair of three pound hand weights. These are optional, but if you have them, grab them now and let's get started with day one. Today we are setting intentions for this program and for the year ahead. To get started, let's just take a moment and really come into our bodies. So taking those hands onto the side of your ribs, Closing down your eyes, taking a deep breath in here, expanding the rib cage. And then exhale through the mouth, taking a moment here to notice how you're feeling in your body in this moment. Taking a moment to shift your awareness inwards taking that deep breath in, creating more space in the body. And then exhale through the mouth, finding that deep core connection. Taking this moment here to get clear on how you wanna show up for yourself today, how you want to feel. Breathing in this fresh energy, inhale. And then as you exhale, Pulling your belly button to spine. When you're ready, gently opening your eyes, coming into the room. We're going to keep this breathing pattern as we start to move our bodies. We're gonna to start to shift our weight back towards our heels, so getting that nice stretch. As you exhale, coming forward, thinking of lifting those abs in towards your spine. As you inhale, shifting your weight back. And exhale, finding that core work, beautiful. Starting to move at a pace that feels good in your body, feels energizing. And we're gonna start to add on here with a little bit of glute work. So starting to take a double pulse through one leg, shifting your weight back, and then the other leg's going to lift. So really focusing on connecting our breath to our movements here thinking of shifting that weight back. Exhale, abs on, lengthening that leg, two little pulses. Good, shifting that weight back. We're gonna do two more on each leg. Seeing if you can think of finding more length through the back of the leg, really squeezing your glutes, beautiful. Waking up that body, starting to really breathe in this fresh energy. Sitting it back, pulse and pulse. We're gonna sit it back and then hold it on our right leg here. So finding a nice long spine here, looking down at the mat, lengthening your leg and really squeezing that glute. Really starting to tune into your body and make that mind muscle connection. Then you're reaching your leg one inch longer. Those hips are facing down here for eight. Beautiful, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. I want you to drop your left forearm down and come into a long leg lift and lower. So we're starting to build that heat and energy in our body, starting to really decide how we wanna show up for ourselves today, how we wanna feel, starting to build that energy up. Beautiful, so lengthening your leg here, thinking of squeezing, pointing those toes for five. Beautiful, four. Lifting with control, three, four, two. Good, one more time. We're gonna hold it here and take it back to those pulses. And maybe you can start to reach your arm forward, create a little more length in your body. Beautiful, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Bring that hand back, tap your knee down. We're gonna lift it up to the sky. Tap all the way down. Press it up, tap it down and up. Start to really build that heat in your body. This is a power Pilates class. We are making the most of this fresh energy. We're really gonna feel connected to our bodies, to what we wanna create, how we wanna feel. So starting to feel that energy lift, squeezing your butt for four. Beautiful, four, three, 
for two, for one. Now we're gonna open those hips over to the side a little bit more and start to squeeze to the side and then push it back. Squeeze to the side, push it back. Here you should really feel your abs working nice and hard starting to switch on through those obliques, through your hips and glutes. And when you're ready, let's start to add a little bit of extra work for that side butt, outer thigh. We squeeze and lift, squeeze and lift. Beautiful, four more, squeeze and lift. Four, three, and lift. Four, two, and lift. One more, you're gonna lift it out, hold it here. One more set of pulses, maybe stretching it out, opening those hips. You've got this for five, four, lifting higher for three, four, two, and one. Beautiful, bringing it in, taking that nice stretch back here. Feeling good, just noticing how your energy is starting to lift here. You really can create this energy for yourself. Use this fresh start, this motivation. Let's come back to those sits and forward, good. Before we come into the other leg, just taking a moment to reset here, shifting back and forward, good. When you're ready, let's come into those lifts. So we do our little pulse here. We shift it back, little pulse, good, and back. So alternating legs here, starting to bring that energy back to your body, starting to really find that nice form. Sitting it back and press and press. Two more, we press, we press one more. It's back, press and press. We're gonna hold it here. So your left leg now is lengthening, finding that alignment in your body. So thinking hips facing down, long spine, really thinking of creating length and strength. Squeeze that butt, stretch your leg for eight, seven, good, six, five, four, three, two, and one. You're gonna drop your right forearm. We're gonna start to lift it all the way up and down. So really lifting with control here, starting to Feel it in your body, that mind-muscle connection. Really squeeze at the top, find that stretch. Drop it down. Your abs here are working really hard to keep you stable. And we lift it up and lower it down. Good, lift and lower. You are doing such a good job. I feel your energy. We are here to create change in our bodies and our minds get stronger. You're doing such a good job. Three. Beautiful, four, two. For one, I want you to hold it. Hips face down, stretch and stretch. Good, maybe reach that arm forward. Create more length, more space in your body for seven, six. Good, for five, four, three, two, and one. I want you to bring it and bring that hand close again. We're gonna bend and stretch. So as you tap down, you're thinking of those abs, right? We are getting that deep core connection here. That bit of movement through the waist. Good, tap and kick, beautiful. Knowing that you can start to, you know, visualize what you want, what results you want, what you want to achieve, and start to bring it into your life. Starting to visualize those muscles working here, lengthening. Lifting, beautiful, four more. Go ahead, four, three, four, two, four, one. I want you to hold it up, open your hips to the side. So now we're getting that side booty and stretching it back. Finding those obliques and stretch. In and out. Good, three more like this before we start to add that lift really starting to make that mind muscle connection, outer thighs, hips, side butt. It is all happening. You are bringing that energy today. Good, I feel you. Let's go, lift and squeeze. Lift and squeeze. 
little lift and squeeze really ooh, lift it up <laughs> let's go three more four two in four one and you're gonna hold one more set of pulses here can you reach that arm that little bit longer for me good abs are in create length energy for six five four three two and one bring it in take that quick sit back here good just taking a deep breath here taking a moment for yourself coming back to your body beautiful we're gonna come forward into a pike so tucking your toes under lifting your hips up to the sky and just taking a moment here feeling that nice release through the back of the legs now take an inhale really scoop your abs in and then as you exhale finding that strong plank position taking an inhale lifting those hips finding that stretch and then as you exhale, coming forward, finding that deep core connection, really lifting your belly button spine. Good, two more times. Inhale, finding that release. And then exhale, deep core connection. You've got this. One more time, inhale. And exhale, coming forward, finding that strong plank for five, four, three, two, and one, piking those hips up. You're gonna walk your hands back to your feet and just take a second here, shake your head out. Good, releasing any tension in your head and neck, soft bend through the knees. We're gonna slowly restack our spine, taking a nice big shoulder roll at the top here. Good, take a deep breath in, breathing in this energy. And then exhale, fold it all the way forward. One more time, releasing through the head and neck. Soft bend through those knees. We're gonna roll ourselves up, big shoulder roll, breathing in this fresh energy. And then stepping ourselves forward to the center of our mats. I am using hand weights for our next series. These are optional, you can do everything without. But we're just gonna get started grounding down through those feet, starting to switch on our core with our breath. So thinking exhale, belly button, spine, Inhale, lowering down. So you're finding that nice posture here. And as you lift, you use that exhale to really find that deep core connection. Beautiful. Just like we did in those planks, thinking of exhale, pull the belly button spine. Beautiful. If you're not using weights, it's all about that mind muscle connection. So really resisting here, like you're moving through thick air, holding, feeling those muscles switch on, and then lowering down. Good, lift and lower, beautiful. Three more like this, switching on that core, those arms, four, two, and lift. Good, one more time, we lift. Now we're gonna start to add a squat, but it's not a really deep squat. We're just thinking of sitting back into that chair, weight in the heels, and then squeezing your butt knobs at the top here. So starting to really switch on those glutes and starting to really build that energy heat in the body. Starting to work more muscles. Good, bring a little bit more intention into each movement. Beautiful, down and up. Four more like this. Really moving slow, feeling it in your body. Four, three, and lift. Good, four, two, and lift. One more, it's down, and lift. Now I want you to take the weights to your chest, lift your right heel off the ground. We're gonna come into a little squat here, putting all the weight into your left foot. So that right leg is lifted, squatting down, lifting up still keeping that nice core engagement maybe you can start to challenge a little bit deeper into that range now and really feeling your calf and thigh switching on on that right side when you're ready let's start to bring those arms back we're gonna lift come into a side leg lift here so starting to add a bit of a balance challenge and lift beautiful. I want you to think of 
moving through each movement with intention. So feeling that squat, lift, side lift, lower. Staying lifted on that tippy toe here. Lengthening through that thigh. We really wanna use our strength. Good, taking the momentum out of it. Finding that power, that energy. Lift and lower, beautiful. Three more. Lift and lower. Two more. Lift and lower. One more time. We are going to lift and lower, but now we're just gonna hold it to the side, coming into that outer thigh lift. So I want you to slow it down and really take momentum out. Find that hold, release, hold, release. Starting to isolate outer thighs. Good, those obliques are working hard here. Beautiful, for eight. Good, finding even more length in your body. Five. Beautiful, for four. We have three. Good, for two. One more time, I want you to hold in that challenge zone and give me a set of pulses here. Finding that length and strength for eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Now you're gonna tap that leg down. We're gonna come into a standing bicycle crunch. So focusing on our waistline, inhale, exhale. So really finding that nice connection, deep core and waist, thinking bicycle crunch. Good, really finding that nice twist. So starting to really switch on the muscles in the waist, deep core, getting into this standing ab work. Exhale and lengthen. Moving with control, you've got this. Five, stay with me, four, good for three, four, two, good. One more time, we're gonna hold it in front. Little lifts here with those low abs. So really focusing low abs, thighs, deep core, good for seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Bringing it in, give yourself a little shake out, reset, and let's come back to the start. So coming into those lifts, starting to connect your breath, and inhale. Good, nice tall posture here. Power Pilates, baby. We are starting this fresh. This is a new beginning where you can create whatever you want for yourself. You can be who you wanna be, be the best version of you. It all starts now, so really get clear. How do you wanna feel? How do you wanna show up? I feel this energy you are bringing. Let's start to make it even bigger here into those squats and lift. Into those squats, lift. So sit back on those heels, lift it up. Sitting back and lift. Good, you know what to do on this side. So I want you to feel confident in yourself. Feel confident in your body and everything it can do. Maybe we can give it all a little bit extra. Down and up, down and up. Beautiful, four more. Really squeeze your butt at the top. Three, four, two. Good, for one, we're gonna come into those heel lifts. So lift your left heel, squat down and lift. Squat down and lift. Really ground down through that right leg. Feel that carving on the left side. Squatting down, lifting up. Squatting down, lifting up. Beautiful, we're gonna start to add that leg lift here. Start to bring that power into it. We're gonna squat down, lift, lengthen your leg to the side. Squat, up, lengthen to the side. So as you lift your leg to the side, really find that strength. You've got this. This is your time for you. You know you can do it. You can do whatever you put your mind to. Let's do it, let's feel good. Let's give it our all. Down and up. Squat it down. Can you get a little lower? Lengthen that leg even more. Four, 
and lift. For three, and lift, you've got this. For two, and lift. One more, it's down, and lift. We're gonna hold to the side. Stretch your leg. I want you to find that length and strength. Lift and lower, lift and lower. Those arms are high, your abs are working. You're finding that stability, length and strength. You've got this, channeling that energy of your strongest self, the version of yourself you're gonna be this year. We are getting strong. We are living our dreams. Let's go, lift it up, lower it down. Lift it up, down, four. Connect to the outer thigh, three, four, two. You have one, let's hold and pulse. Use that core strength. Stretch your leg one inch longer, seven. Six, five, four, three, two, and one. We tap it down, standing abs. Getting into that bike crunch. Last bit of standing work today. So let's really go for it here. Bring some power into each movement. You've got this. We are in it together. Let's go, we exhale. Find that lengthen and twist, stretch. Twist, four, for three, for two, hello abs, for one. We're gonna hold in front, little lift. Find that low ab connection. Let's go, pull it up for eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Shake it out. All right, you've made it through the standing work. We are going to come down to the mat and finish off with some abs. So coming on down here, let's take those ankle weights onto our wrists if you are using them. So just taking a second and popping them on before we get into this mat ab series. Good, popping those on and let's lay ourselves down onto the mat. And once you're here, let's just take a couple of breaths, just like at the start of class, coming back to our core, back to our breath, back to ourselves. Take a deep breath in, expanding the rib cage. And then as you exhale, pulling that belly button to spine, tucking that tailbone. Good, inhale, finding that length. And exhale, finding that deep core connection. And when you're ready, let's reach the arms up overhead, finding that length. And then exhale, scoop ourselves forward into our ab curl. Inhale, finding that beautiful length without popping at the ribs. And then exhale, scooping those abs as we curl. Don't worry about curling too high here. We really want to think of activating that deep core, finding that belly button spine connection, scooping the abs in. Good, inhale and exhale, connecting to your breath. Two more like this, starting to build that heat in your core. One more, inhale and exhale, lift your right leg into tabletop. From here, we're gonna reach the arms and legs and then curl it up. So thinking of working those lower and upper abs, starting to really bring that heat into it. Beautiful, seven more like this, curling it up and lengthening. Good, curl and lengthen. Give me four and stretch. Four, three and stretch. You've got this, two and lengthen. One more time, you're gonna hold, pulse those arms. So really finding that energy through the fingers for seven, six, five, four, three, two, when your hands come behind your head, you're gonna reach it up and over, find that bicycle crunch, and then lengthen that leg out. Exhale, up and over. Inhale, lengthen. So really working with your breath and starting to get that opposite rib to hip connection, working your waist, and starting to build that heat a little bit deeper. Good, up and over, and down. Three more, it's over and down for two, over, and down. One more, 
over. You're gonna hold, reach it past here. Really reach, reach up and over. Feel those obliques for six, five, four, three, two, and one. You're gonna lower it down, reset, take that breath. We're gonna lengthen out through that left leg and start to curl it up. Inhale, lengthen, exhale, lift. Inhale, lengthen, exhale, lift. Beautiful. Really focus on keeping that abdominal wall scooped, not letting it dome out here. Thinking belly button, spine with each exhale, letting that breath help you. Good, reach. Four more, exhale. Bring that energy up here. Three, you've got this. Two. One more time, you're gonna hold, pump those arms, pump, pump. Maybe you can lift an inch higher. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one, hands behind the head. We cross it over and then lengthen it down. So really find that length, that beautiful stretch through the stomach, through the thigh, up and over. Inhale, exhale, inhale. Exhale, you've got this, five. Up and over, four. Really work through that waist for three, four, two. One more time, you're gonna hold and reach. Find that energy, find that pulse, let's go. It's eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two. And one, you're gonna lower it down, reach those hands to the sky, reset. Good, reset, reach those fingers to the sky, level two, we're gonna lift those legs to tabletop. We're gonna inhale, exhale, reach it forward. Inhale, exhale. If you're ready to start to challenge those abs a little more, just that right side, lengthens and bends. Lengthens and bend. So really find that beautiful lengthening. Starting to check in with that deep core. Making sure we're not rocking through the hips. We are using our breath for four. Beautiful. Three, four, two. Creating that length and strength. For one, you're gonna hold, pump the arms for eight, seven, six, five. Stretch your leg for four. You've got this, three. Two, one, you're gonna take your hands behind your head, reach up and over to that opposite leg for five. You've got this, four, building that heat. Three, four, two, four, one. Bring it in, reset, we're gonna do the other side. So taking those exercises we just did, building that heat, Building that strength, showing ourselves we can do whatever we put our mind to, right? We can do the hard things. We are strong and powerful, let's go. Just that left leg this time, lengthens and bends. Lengthens and bends. Remember to breathe, give yourself a smile. You got this, you are doing such a good job. You are getting closer to your goals with each breath, each movement, four. Beautiful, four, three, stay with me. Four, two, good, for one, you're gonna hold, pump those arms, eight, seven, stretch your legs, six, curl higher, five, four, you're so close, three, two, one, hands behind the head, up and over, opposite knee, for five, you've got this. For four, stay with it. For three, four, two, Four, one, pull those knees in, hands behind your head. We finish it off, 10 ab bikes, nice and slow together, let's go. It's 10, hold it here. Nine, nice and slow, beat in this burn. You've got this. Good, side to side, you have six, slow it down. Be in your body, show yourself, I got this. Let's go, four, three, stay with me, two, and one, good, release it down. Take that nice big full body stretch here. Give yourself a smile. I am so proud of you for showing up for yourself today. Just want you to take a moment here and close down your eyes. 
just like at the start of class, shifting your awareness back to your body, taking a deep belly breath. Exhale, sighing out anything you don't need. Breathing in this beautiful energy you've just created for yourself, inhale. And exhale, letting yourself soften. One more time, deep breath in, stretching your body, inhale. And exhale, beautiful. And then slowly and gently, we are going to make our way up to seated for a nice big stretch and meditation. So taking those weights off, we are done with them today. You just did the most amazing job. And I am so happy to have you here with me. When you're ready, let's reach up and over here, just flowing through that beautiful side stretch, taking a moment to slow down, to show our bodies that bit of love and care, just working so hard for us. And then releasing forward here, letting your body soften, coming back to your breath, deep breath in and exhale, one more, inhale, and exhale. Good, coming through center, nice big shoulder roll. Let's go to the other side. Feels so nice to do something good for our bodies, to show up for ourselves in a way that feels really good. Just flowing through it, finding that nice side stretch. And then exhale, shifting forwards, releasing here, letting go. Coming back to your breath, inhale. And exhale. Inhale. And exhale. Good, slowly we're stacking that spine. We're gonna cross those legs and let's just walk forward, coming into a nice glute stretch here. Crawling those fingertips forwards, feeling that release, inhale. And exhale. Inhale. And exhale. And then slowly restack your spine. Let's cross that opposite leg on top. Walk ourselves forward. Just let those glutes release. Giving yourself this moment for you before you head into the rest of the day, inhale. And exhale, letting go. Inhale. And exhale. And then when you're ready, slowly, slowly, gently restacking the spine, taking a nice shoulder roll here. We're gonna finish off with an intention setting meditation. So taking those palms facing up to receive fresh energy inspiration, closing down your eyes, lengthening your body, lengthening through the spine, inhale, and exhale. Taking this moment and just shifting your awareness back to yourself and taking a moment to get clear on what it is you want to call into your life this year. What would you create for yourself? What would your life look like if anything could happen? I want you to really dream big here. Put no limits on yourself, knowing that anything is possible for you and you can create whatever it is you put your mind to. So just taking this moment to visualize what your dream life looks like. Really bringing in all the details, letting yourself get excited about this new beginning. And then starting to get clear on the version of yourself that you need to be to make these dreams a reality. How will you show up for yourself each day? What is your energy like? How do you speak to yourself? What are the habits and routines 
that help you thrive. Taking a moment to get clear and visualize your ideal self, the version of yourself that you can embody in this moment. I want you to feel your body light up with this energy on the inhale and exhale, letting go of the old, whatever you don't want to bring into this fresh start. And just taking a moment now to sit in this energy that you've created, setting your intention of how you want to feel, how you want to show up each day of this challenge, each day of this year, and start to align your energy with what you want and who you're going to be. Really feeling this in your body, keeping that deep belief that everything is possible for you, that your dreams are in your heart for a reason, and you already have everything that it takes inside of you. Let's lock this in now, taking a deep breath in, reaching the arms up overhead, connecting the palms, aligning our energy with our intentions. And then as you exhale, bring those palms to heart center. Just taking a moment here, giving yourself a smile. And when you are ready, opening your eyes and giving yourself a huge round of applause. I am so proud of you for showing up today and taking the time to do something that will really set you up for this challenge for this year. It's so powerful to take time and really get clear on what it is we want to achieve in our lives, the version of ourselves that we need to be in order to make those dreams a reality. And I am here to guide you through this process through each day of this program. And I just want you to know that everything is possible for you. This is your fresh start. And I am so, so proud of you for making it all begin today. And I cannot wait to move through the rest of this program with you. I will see you in the next one.